Welcome back. In this video we want to look at the photoelectric effect and the features of this experiment and how these features support the particle theory um, but not the wave theory. First of all, what we see in the photoelectric effect is the first feature um, which uh, we know that the kinetic energy or the maximum kinetic energy is proportional to the frequency of the incoming light. So the maximum kinetic energy of the uh, released electrons is proportional to the frequency of the incoming light. This supports the particle theory because you know that uh, photon energy oops, photon energy is proportional to frequency according to our equation A equals HF where that is the uh, Planck's constant. Um, so that supports the, uh, this feature. However, according to the wave theory, your um, kinetic energy is proportional to intensity. Intensity. However, this is not seen. Um, because you can increase the intensity um, of the incoming light. However, if it falls below the threshold frequency, you won't have any light release. So that is um, seen, but this is not seen in this experiment. Let's think about the second feature that we see in the photoelectric effect. The second feature is that the release of photoelectrons electrons is immediate. And so the particle theory says that um, one photon releases one electron. And that's what we see. However, the wave theory um, would allow energy to build up, and so um, the release would not be immediate because as the energy is building up, the electron is gaining energy, and eventually when there's enough energy, um, the electron will be, re will be released. Released after build up of energy. So, once again, we see this happening, but we do not see this happening. That's the second feature of the photoelectric effect. Um, let's think about one more feature that supports the particle theory but not the wave theory. Um, and that feature, number three, is that um, light below a certain frequency, let's call that the threshold frequency, does not release um, electrons. Now the particle theory says that we need a um, threshold frequency or shows that we need a threshold frequency um, to release electrons. So that supports that, that feature. Um, however, the wave theory once again allows there to be a low frequency beam uh, continuous on the metal surface and eventually the energy will build up um, until eventually you have enough energy to release the electrons. So once again, a build-up of low frequency. We can see from our experimental results that this occurs, but this does not occur. So there we have three features and the explanations of why the photoelectric uh, effect experiment supports the particle theory of light, but does not support the wave theory of light.